All right, Frank, here's the red face. This was actually for the client before you. Uh, tweezers look like they're causing a shadow. Oh, I see. Just use a different light source. Uh, this was actually for the RGB client before you, uh, but I didn't like how, how this looked. It was too crowded, so uh, Al had another red one that we put in. Uh, I think it was Daniel's car. Um, so this is the uh, red with silver. And you can go to my YouTube channel and look at uh, Daniel's uh, red gauge face. There's probably some better, better pictures um, of it on there. Where's my favorite? Is Aqua right there? That's my favorite. So anyway, this is what the. Uh, let's get it. Get try white. Is that right? Let's see. Um. I'll post this for you so you can see the uh, the red face, but uh, e even this looks so much smoother and brighter than the grainy uh, transparency. So, but um, no blame to Al. He he does fantastic work. He really does. He's made some amazing stuff. So, um, and and it's still a little dim down here. Not much I can do about that. Maybe, but. I uh, might be able to cut this out a little more, but this is what's supporting this centerpiece. So, and I cut this one down last night, or night before last, whenever I made your video, I didn't mention that, but it had gone up and I cut it down some more. And uh, I guess I'm going to try and get another set of three strips to go right here. I've got the wire here, if I can move that out of the way so we can get the 2000 RPM a little brighter for you. Uh, but I've got to replace this and then add one more strip, but that's not going to happen tonight because I'm fixing to go to Dreamland after two beers with lime in it. All right, I'll post this, dude.